Welcome back to Teardown, where this Space and Rockets mod has recently been updated. So, you might be wondering who's going to fly this thing. Well, we've got here an astronaut. Forget the astronaut, because we're actually taking this guy right here. Now, I'm going to be honest, he is not actually going to be piloting the rocket. Is that even the right terminology? Pilot a rocket? Yeah, he's not going to be the astronaut, okay? We're going to put him right there. And also, Beans is going to come on this trip with us. So, Beans, you just go ahead and place yourself right there. Oh, no. Ooh, easy. That'll do. So my plan is to actually just go ahead and weld them to the rocket. I hope this works. Okay, there we go. Weld tool done. Oh, yes. No. Oh, oh, sorry, buddy. It worked with beans, but not the ragdoll. Do you not want to go to space? I got it. Right. He's attached with his arm. Oh, he's freaking out a little bit. Now on the mod page, it says, if damaged, the rocket will play an alarm and may fall apart. Really hope that doesn't happen. All right, here we go. Test number one. Oh, we're tilting already. All right, you know what? I say we just go ahead and launch the rocket. Here we go. And lift off. Hold on, everyone. Wow, they're actually holding on pretty well. Look at Beans go. Beans is fine, by the way. He's indestructible, okay? He won't die, but the Ragdoll, on the other hand, might. All right, we're passing. I think we're into the stratosphere. Pass the ozone layer. Come on, we're probably higher than Mount Everest right now. Oh, here we go. <gasps> we're in space that it's uh how insane is this mod right here okay beans is good ragdoll on the other hand i am not too sure about remember this is only test one we have a lot of tests to get through oh cool we can see the inside of the rocket so i can actually control this um but you know we're only going straight up anyway so i'm just gonna keep holding space that's how we accelerate and just see what happens basically the earth is getting a lot smaller right now i can no longer see it are we in space oh is that the sun it's bright must be the sun. The ragdoll just holding on still. Right, we've been going for quite a while now. So what I'm going to do is stop accelerating. And wait, can I even stop accelerating? Oh, there we go. And jump out. Oh, whoa, what the? Rocket? There it is. I need to try and catch up. Of course, it's still accelerating extremely fast. Well, I've lost the rocket. So the only way is down. Oh, oh, oh. Beans? Is that you? Oh, you made it down. Hey, buddy. Oh, I thought I'd never see you again. All right, so I've got a new rocket now, and I've also lined up a bunch of ragdolls, including an unturned zombie, because I've just booted up the Unturned Life series on the second channel, Fudgy Games. So that's right, my friend. You are going to space. I've also got an Among Us crewmate, because, you know, I thought this guy might have some experience. We also have an injured guy over here, so I'm just gonna... Yeah, just... Get rid of him. And then a little bit later, just because I can, I'm going to send the Megalodon shark into space. That's if it works. But for now, if all the ragdolls could board this rocket, that would be fantastic. That's it. Unturned zombie, you can go there. And then finally, the crewmate. I wonder if this right here is an imposter. Time to get the weld tool back out. Weld them all to the rocket. I'm not exactly sure how the weld tool mod works. I'm just kind of clicking and hoping for the best here. All right, hopefully. That has done the trick. Oh, yes, I think it has. They're all sticking to the rocket pretty well. Oh, apart from this guy. Oh, no, get get up. <laughs> we can't leave you behind. All right, there we go. We're ready to go. Beans, you stay right here, okay? Oh, we're tipping over. All right, you know what? Three, two, one, take off. Just a little bit of acceleration. Oh, this looks epic. Yes, this is so cool. Okay, a little bit more acceleration. Maybe we'll take it nice and slow this time. No, there's no rush to get to space, right? So many ragdolls. Wait, can I jump out? Would the rocket just launch without me? It looks so cool. Right, accelerate just a little bit more. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Yes, we have lift off just about. Oh, more acceleration. Take it nice and slow. All right, you know what? Full speed. Here we go. Hold on, everyone. We're into space. Actually, I'll tell you what. As soon as we can see the Earth, what I'll do is I'll slow down and we might just be able to experience zero gravity. Hopefully, we go high enough. Oh, here we go. Everyone's still holding on. Okay, let's slow it right down. Oh, wait. Can we actually fall back to Earth? Oh, you know what? Let's try that out, shall we? I hope we don't crash land. Also, look at the Among Us character. The crewmate is actually giving us a little bit of light. Thanks, buddy. Much appreciated. Wait, some something just detached. What is that? Have we lost a ragdoll? Oh, no. Something is definitely flying off. I don't think we're going down anymore. Hang on. I'm going to try and jump out. Oh, my rocket. No. Come back. Oh, I caught it. This is so weird. Oh, wait. Is it zero gravity? Oh, my goodness. I actually think it is. We're in space. Hey, everyone. How are you all doing? Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, the crewmate. Don't worry. I've got you, buddy. 
get back over there. That's it. Ooh, easy. A bit of damage, but you know what? That's fine, right? Right, crewmate, go back down, all right? Can we all go back down? There it is. Planet Earth. Well, Earth is a little different than I expected. Oh, wait, what the? We're back through. I think we might have lost some ragdolls as well. Where are we? I see land. We did it. We've made it back down to Earth. Do we have any survivors? Oh, that's a very good question, actually. Okay, uh, definitely not. This guy? Didn't realize that. Okay, dead? De okay, yeah. I mean, obviously, we have no survivors. <laughs> <laughs> Who's going to survive that? Also, the crewmate is just nowhere to be seen. Now, of course, I have no idea if this is actually going to work or not. But let's give it a good go. So we have the Megalodon shark here. Um, what's the best way of doing this? Maybe uh, have it so... Oh, yeah, if he can see up. That'd be great. Wait, is he bigger than the rocket? Oh, he's literally the same size as the rocket. Okay, maybe a little bit smaller. But still, that's pretty insane. Right, you're going right there, right in the center. I hope the weld tool is strong enough for this. Oh, I broke his jaw a little bit. All right, and weld together. It's working. Oh, no. Quick, get the rocket. Get the rocket. Of course, it weighs way too much. Don't worry. I reckon we can recover this. Oh, here we go. No way. There is no way this is going to work. Full power. Here we go. How is the rocket still working? Come on. Here we go. Sending a Megalodon shark into space. Come on. It's really struggling right now. <laughs> this is so weird. I never thought I'd be doing this in teardown today. It's actually working. We are currently flying a shark into space. This is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. And the ragdolls are still attached as well. Let's go. We were in space or our space for a while, but now it seems like we're going down. Something doesn't seem right here at all. I'm currently at full power, but yeah, we are. We're going back down to earth. Okay, this isn't good. Oh no. Oh my goodness, we just crashed. The world around us just spawned in. What? The shark just slammed right into the ground. Yeah, sorry. We're getting rid of this one. Um, bye everyone. Now for my next experiment, I want to purposely actually crash the rocket and kind of see what it's like to blow it up. And also I'm on this new Californian house map which looks absolutely incredible. Wait, what? Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, I haven't really checked it out yet, to be honest. But I am going to go ahead and pretty much just go ahead and destroy this place. Oh my, this place is insane. This map is actually incredible. Look at this. And then I've just gone ahead and planted a rocket right in the yard. All right, here we go. <laughs> Let's see how much damage we can do to the house. And also the rocket, shall we? Yes, yeah, definitely not recommended to uh, launch a rocket in your own garden. Okay, here we go. Reduce the speed. <laughs> Let's just go through the house, shall we? Whoa. Oh, this is so weird. Oh, man, I'm losing control. I cannot control this rocket right now. Oh, we haven't done too much damage yet. Whoa. Oh, no, what's happened? Right, I'm coming in for landing, but on the roof this time. Oh. There's just so much detail in this house. I'm ripping through it right now. I mean, this house right here is worth a lot of money. Rocket coming down. Here we go. Oh, right. Tilt back up. I need to do more damage to the rocket. Yeah, you know what? Let's just land it. And maybe we can use some modded weapons to do as much damage as possible. I mean, this is what I've done to the house so far. Could have been a lot worse. Right. So the lava gun. Oh, no. I forgot it does that. Eh, might as well do it a little bit more. Is it still going to fly off this? Oh, I can hear a noise. Does it still fly? Yeah. Now I definitely shouldn't be riding this rocket. Oh, oh no, it fell apart. It's done what it said it would do in the mod page. Oh no, my rocket is totaled. Man, what an epic mod. Might as well destroy it just a little bit more. Perfect. Wow, look what I just found under the map right here. Amazing. I love it. Now in the last teardown episode, I was playing on this bunker map right here. And I got this comment on screen. It says, hey, Fudgy, what will happen if you use the bunker buster on the bunker map? So that is actually a really, really good idea. Now, in the last one, I tried to survive a nuke. It kind of worked. And then it was just a little bit too powerful after that with a different type of nuke. So with the airstrike mod, basically, you can get the bunker buster, which is this one. And it should, in theory, completely destroy the bunker that I'm in. So let's uh, place it. Uh, let's see. Right there. Okay, here we go. Will the bunker survive? Or will I survive? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, okay. Well, wait, did it, did it work? Hang on. It's left a mark. No way. Let's see what it looks like from the outside. The bunker actually did its job. 
it kept me alive. So that's where it landed. I'm pretty shocked by that. Let me send in another one. How many can I send? It's just one at a time. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Oh, yep. Completely fine. I have no idea how it doesn't get through. It's just so powerful. What about the Moab? Isn't that basically a nuke? Um, okay. I might regret this. Here we go. Oh, um, okay. Yep. <laughs> the bunker did not survive that one. Nor did I. Subscribe.